<laughs> in the nice cool room. Oh, that's controversial. Now. Yeah, it's, it's so I'm sorry. Um, but it, obviously, with the extreme heat warnings, we decided this morning that it maybe wasn't the best idea to do the concert on the lawn and having people pass out willy-nilly. So we decided to do it in here, which I think will be lovely. Um, so I'm Christy Locker. I'm the assistant director for the libraries. I just wanted to say a quick thank you to the friends of the library, several of them are in the front row, um, who support these concerts year-round. You know, in the summer we're outside, usually in the winter we're in Richardson, and the friends support all of that, so we can't thank them enough. Um, I did want to let you know we have one last outdoor, fingers crossed, you know, the weather cooperates, uh, outdoor concert in August, August 20th. We're going to be having the Van Buren on the lawn. That will be our last outdoor concert before we move inside for September, and we've got a great lineup planned September through December. So stay tuned for information about that. Um, but I don't want to hold up the actual show any longer than that. I'd like to turn it over to Jumpin' Juba. Thank you. Thank you. We're not saying you can't pass out, you just can't pass out willy nilly. <laughs> Thank you. 
gonna do a we're gonna do a Beatles tune next, but by the time we're done with it, I'm not sure if you'll recognize it. But we'll find out if anybody does. So we're gonna do an instrumental, change it up a little bit. Here we go.
best sales force, I guess. It's called Best Buy in Town. Best Buy in Town. Series. Thank you guys. <laughs> Many years ago, I was actually I was actually playing a gig at uh, I think at Braintree at the Thayer Library, and I got up on the mic and the 
Thayer Library, and I said, thanks to the Crane Library for coming <laughs> for a moment. And he said, no, you're, right? So you figure that, and that wasn't the end of it, because I ended up uh, playing a, a concert in Quincy at, uh, I think it was a Stop and Shop Plaza, and I said, you know, later in the summer, we'll be over at the Thayer Library. And you're like, you mean the Quincy Library? You mean, you mean the Crane Library? And so it just goes back and forth, and I just confuse them. They're two fine libraries, you know. It's not an insult to confuse them, but it ain't right either. <laughs> Thanks for coming to the Crane Library, where we are too. And here's an old, uh, we're going to do an old spiritual, uh, it's an instrumental version of an old spiritual, uh, I think that goes back, goes back pretty far, 19th century. Great Awakening or something like that. I, I just want the melody, basically. But it's, um, yeah, it's, it's good. It's a good song. It's a song that kind of conveys a little hope. Or at the very least, is a real nice melody that you can do instrumentally. Wait in the water, this one. Wait in the water. Thank you. 
Change it up a little bit. A little tune called In My Finer Moments, this one, In My Finer Moments. Thank you. 
tribute to all the all the teams and crews that made those shots happen. We don't want to see real cops go over any real cliffs. We're just talking about we're just talking about yeah movies and TV and the soundtracks. This, this is soundtrack music to to the dramatic scene there. Okay, so Crown Victoria Club Jive. Here we go. Be a bizarre little story, but we are going to 
We're going to tell a story with this next one. This one's in a, in a style of music called the Talking Blues. You guys have heard of that? People attribute it to uh, Woody Guthrie, but because uh, he did a lot of them. He did a lot of really good ones, but it actually goes back even further than Woody Guthrie into the 1920s. Some recording director ran up upon some hillbillies who had the blues but couldn't sing. <laughs> so that's how they worked that out. Just let them talk to me. Talk their way out of trouble. This is one in that tradition. It's called, it's a little story about the rambling burglar. It's my CD slap happy. Blue sky. I was thinking how good it is to be alive when that family man pulled 
Soka tune called Through the Motions. This one's called Through the Motions. One more time, thanks to the Crane Public Library for having us today. Give them a big hand for, for supporting the arts in Quincy, like a few others do. You guys are lucky to have a library this good. Boston library system is legendary, but they, 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 they can be kind of uh, carpy. They're not friendly like they are here all the time. So, uh, God knows who, who or what's coming after them in, uh, in Boston, but um, everybody does the best they can. So support your local library and uh, let them know that you support them. They really need that right now. All right, here we go. Through the motions. Thank you. 
thanks to the library. Thank you guys for being here today. Stay cool, stay healthy, we'll see you again. Go to my website, stevepearl.com. Find out where else we're playing, because we're going to be uh, doing a few more shows this summer. Thank you, guys.